hi guys welcome back to my channel if you are stopping by right now or you clicked on this video definitely shows that definitely means that you want to know how um to couple this baby product set mine up myself with the manual and i'm ready to show you how i did mine quite it was quite easy i'm not perfect but i got it right and if i can do it you can do it remember to hit the subscribe button or give me a thumbs up if i did a great job please so that i can keep doing this with all my baby products so i'm taking it out and You have this, you have to make sure the parts are complete. This one too, and, and this. So this is what the, the you know the other the whole. I think I'm gonna need the scissors to cut it out. Screws in total. There are four screws in total. So um so you have this one, two, you have three four five then you have this six the one that comes on top with two dangling cute toys you have this part seven and you have this part eight then the four screws making nine so i'm just telling you everything that um there this part. So this is so there's a pin here, like so you, you kind of press it. Yeah, and it's just in there. And that's that's the same for the lower part. So you, you press this part so let's go. There's a pin here. You just press it. And it goes in there. So I do the same. I do the same for this way. I don't think even if you don't want to press it, you just. I think it's better. It's easier when you push it, put pressure on, on it. Then. You turn it over. Oh, that and that's it. Yeah. Oh, the second step. I don't know. So it says. Um, I'll put this one and I'll attach this one to it. So it goes the same way where there's a stop here. Just press it on this one. And do the same here. So we have this then. So this is where the screw comes in. Fourth step is attach this part. There are two um two holes here. Yeah? The screws actually meant for this. I don't you're going to screw this in. Okay. So we're going to screw this in. Yeah. Mm. Nice. So I got a screwdriver. Get the one that fits the.
Zettel, Zeit. Zeit. So, yeah, so this is it. This I'm putting a battery in it. So, if I unscrew this, I'm putting a battery in it. Then, insert it here. It's going to be like putting it inside. After putting the battery, insert it. Yeah, so this is where you see eight is wearing this. Yeah, look out this stuff, you can cause suffocation. this part back and, oh Nick is to adjust the strap from inside when you have your baby so I think it's for this one here yeah, I'm correct behind is for this so we're gonna fix it here you take this behind yeah and that is that was the structure the same as you do then yeah. I think it just makes it look proper okay My baby is a tall baby, so I will just do that. So if your baby is um, smaller, you just adjust it, you know, put it, I don't know if you can see, you put it here or here if your baby is smaller. My baby is tall, so I don't even need to bother myself making it small. Everything I do now, I'll make it there. <laughs> so you just, um, I don't have a problem with these kind of straps, but When I get it done over, so I put it in the first hole of this plan. I take it back to the last one. So yeah. So this is how I do it. I don't know if I'm getting it right, but it should do the job. Okay. Do the job. So every time you want to adjust it, you just drag it. Just keep dragging. Keep dragging. Yeah, or keep pulling. And this is to adjust your baby, the the, the wigs. 
you can press the middle to you to get the clip off. You have to press this middle here, press it out both ways, and put it back both ways. Like this. So now it's time for the Mickey Baby Mouse. Get this. Yeah. Okay. That is it. My boy is sleeping right now. It's not that I've showed you how it looks like. I'm going to feel. I'm going to find out. So if you want to recline the chair, you press. You see this part. You see this part here. Is the other on the other side too? You press it down. You, you can, if the baby is kind of crying, you could just use your leg and push it, and it just goes. And I need to know if my son likes it, but you have to be careful with this. In case to you know, your baby's face, if your baby is like on the last side of the, the on this part where you have to adjust your, your baby's um adjusting rope is here or adjusting strap goes through here, so it means that your baby's head is around this area. You have to be careful with this. Let me take it out. I don't know, probably, but I'm gonna test on my baby to know. So you take it this way, it's back on this side. In the sitting position, take it that way, is that way. I mean, I'm quite tall, guys. Look at the video. So, like this, is in a rocking position, like you can the rocker. Then, when you want to take it out, you pull this backwards and it's balanced. In case your baby is sleeping and you don't want to rock the baby. So you see, it makes that sound. You take it back, it becomes a rock, a rocker. Your baby, and now the baby is sleeping, you want to get the baby to in a stabilized position. You could just push it back, push this backwards, and it falls backwards. So you don't have to go all the way down, squat or bend down to do this. You can see the battery that is requesting. And I don't have the battery at home. My mom doesn't have also. Um, so something I noticed about this while I was trying to take this out, trying to unscrew this, I need to tell you, I was screwing this out. It wasn't coming out. It was loose, but it wasn't coming out. So after I then, I said I was loose. I took a knife. I don't, I'm not saying you should do this, but look for something that is very common there with you. I I put a knife into the other part of it, like the upper side, not where the screw, screw is. So I don't know if it's gonna show. I put a knife here. I put a knife like here, and I. I kind of put a little force and I brought it out. 